Extra cargo space is one of the great features of your 2013 GMC Yukon. To easily move your back seats for that extra space, or to allow quick passenger entry and exit, I have two words for you, fold and tumble. Second row seating. Let's take a look at that second row first. You can fold and tumble the second row of seats in your vehicle manually or automatically from the outside of your vehicle or from the inside sitting in the third row. To manually move the seats while outside your vehicle, first make sure there is nothing to interfere with the movement of the seat and that all the seat belts are unbuckled. Lift the lever on the outside of the seat and the seat will fold. Lift the lever again and the rear of the seat is released from the floor. The seat is now tumbled. To fold and tumble the second row manually while sitting in the third row, look for this release lever on the inside of the second row seats and lift in the same fold and tumble sequence. As you may expect, the process of folding and tumbling the second row seats automatically is much easier and can be done from outside the vehicle or from the third row. First, make sure the vehicle is in park and that the second row seats are empty. Look for this button located on the exterior wall near each seat. Press the button and see what happens. To return to the seated position, pull the seat down until it latches to the floor and raise the seat back. Third row seating. Third row seats can be folded, folded and tumbled, or removed depending on your cargo needs. Start by opening the lift gate of your vehicle. From the back of the third row, lift the release lever found here on the outside bottom rear of the seat. The seat back folds forward. To return that same seat to the upright position, use the same release lever to upright the seat back. It's important to push and pull on the seat to make sure it's locked. This way you know your passengers are safe. After folding the third row seats, they can also be tumbled forward for more room. Make sure the headrests are completely lowered and the seat and floor area is clear. There is a lever and handle located near the bottom of the seat. Do you see it? Unlatch the seat from the floor by lifting the lever. Then lift the rear of the seat up from the floor. Tilt it forward to its upright position. To return the third row seat from a tumbled position, do the same procedure in reverse. There are times when you will need to totally remove the third row seats and reinstall them back into your vehicle. To remove the third row seat, fold the seat back forward using the lever as before. Unlatch the seat from the floor by pulling the handle toward the rear of the vehicle. Roll the seat out of the vehicle. There is a track in the floor to guide the seat wheels out of the vehicle. To reinstall the third row seat, slide the front seat wheels into the track on the floor and roll the seat forward until it latches and locks into place. Push and pull on the seat to make sure it is locked into place. Raise the seat back to the upright position. Make sure the safety belts are returned to the original position over the seat backs and you and your back seats are good to go. Fold and tumble, fold and tumble, fold and tumble.